Welcome friends, Lost Scarf here, and it's time for another Scarf Plays where we spend time looking at a game. See if uh, we want to recommend it or not eventually in the future. Right now we're going to try Fury of Dracula's Digital Edition. This is a board game made digital by Nomad Games. And it's $20. So, definitely curious because it's the board games. Let's check out the tutorial here. Hopefully it's not a very long tutorial. Gen tutorial. The basics. Oh no, you go into gameplay for it. Okay. I like the going for like the old school feel here. Welcome to Fear of Jackula. One versus many game of gothic horror and hidden evil. I'm curious. One versus many. Four vampire hunters use their powers of deduction to chase the elusive Dracula across Europe and thus end his reign of terror. Dracula used hidden movement to avoid the hunters whilst laying deadly traps and spawning new vampires along his trail. The hunters win if they find and destroy Dracula before his influence engulfs Europe. Dracula wins if he accumulates 13 influence points by creating new vampires and defeating the hunters. The game is played over a series of rounds, with each round having a hunter phase followed by a Dracula phase. Makes sense. Each hunter phase contains both a day and night where the hunters can perform different actions. During the Dracula phase, Dracula moves across Europe as he leaves Terra in his wake. As he travels, Dracula leaves behind a trail which the hunters can discover to track him down. Check out the rest of our tutorials to learn how to play the game or the in-game manual for more advanced rules. Next tutorial, yeah. Okay, that was pretty fast. That's good. A good hunter needs to understand their tools, so in this tutorial, we'll go through all the information the game will present you with. You now my favorite digital to digital board game has got to be Ticket to Ride. It was very easy to understand. It was really good. I don't know if I did a recommendation video a couple years back when that was the thing. There's a game board that's split into seven regions. Austro-Hungary, Hungary, Baltica, Britannica, Gallia, German, Germania, Iberia, and Italia. Okay. Regions contain a number of large cities and the large square-shaped locations. Oh, large, uh, small cities, smaller diamonds. Yeah, okay. All cities are connected by roads, the red lines and railways. The red lines are roads, white are railways, and yellow striped ones are... Oh, white and yellow striped ones. Okay, so white striped and yellow striped are both railways. Red lines are roads. The, word, the blue ones are boats, then. Cities that are on the coastline are ports, and they are presented by blue roofs. Camera zoom button allows a selection uh, of the zoom button. Yeah, makes sense. When on Mac mode, the camera will change based on the current play action being played. Zoom in, zoom out. This is the action bar where you will find all your available actions. <laughs> That's a lot of things you can do. Up here is the pause menu where you can access settings and or exit the game. Move action allows you to move across. You know what's another di good digital board game? Is Clue. Uh, also Risk. Risk is a pretty good digital board game too, honestly. Pass action ends the current hunter's turn with no further effect. Okay, that's what we're doing. Move around, pass action, reserve ticket action, draws a train ticket, which you'll need to use trains. Okay. Rest allows you to remove one point of damage from a hunter. Okay. Search action reveals an encounter card if the searched location is on Dracula's trail. Special action activates a hunter's special ability and allows hunters to use cards from their hand if they can do so. Supply action draws event and item cards for you to use. Trade action allows you to trade items between the hunters in the same location. Okay, all right, cool, cool. This is the current hunter's hand area, so any cards and tickets they have collected will be kept here. These are the item cards. These cards are useful tools that the hunters can use to bounce the odds in their favor. They're, these are event cards. They represent events in the game that happen during the hunt. Most hunters can only hold a maximum of three items or three and three event cards in their hand. However, Dr. John Seward's ability allows him to have four. All right. Dracula cannot see your items unless you have been bitten. You must reveal one card per act of bite. Unfortunately for Mina Harker, who always has one bite, she must always have one card revealed. Wow. Also, Mina Harker's a character. Because, of course, she got bit. Okay. You can view each hunter's character card by selecting their name shown uh, below their portrait. Next. This is the game clock, which shows the current phase. All right. Notice that as phases change, so does the look of the game. Spooky. Oh, okay. That's a lot of phases. Dawn, day, dusk, night, and Dracula phase. The day and night phases are the only phases in which the hunters may make actions. During dawn and dusk phase, the hunters fight with Dracula if he is revealed. 
The Dracula phase is Dracula's turn. During this this phase, he moves. The game clock also shows the current level of despair, which is equal to the number of weeks that have passed. Alright. Time to learn how to set up a game of Fury of Dracula. The first phase of the game is setup phase, which they will go through now. During this phase, all hunters and Dracula are placed on the board. Characters are always placed in this order. Lord Godalming, God, God damning, God darling, Dr. John Seward, Van Helsing, of course, Amina Harker, and then finally Dracula. Let's place the hunters starting with God damning, God, God, Godalming, Godalming, by selecting a region. Next, select the highlighted location within the region to place Godalming here. The Lord guy here. Well done, you have placed Lord Godalming on the board. Next is John Seward, so select a region for him. Okay. Put him in sit over here. We'll put him right here. Now place Van Helsing. That's the picture for Van Helsing? Alright. Figured he'd have a cooler sh picture, but okay. Van Helsing goes there. And Mina Harker will be over here. Bucharest. In this game, Dracula is controlled by AI, so he will be placed automatically once all hunters have been placed. Once everyone has been placed, the game can begin. Exitorial. I can only assume Dracula is a player, so you need like five players for this game. But for net, but Dracula, of course, needs to be AI, because of course we would see what Dracula is doing. Welcome to the first game round. Uh, one round consists of all five phases. As a hunter, your aim is to find and defeat Dracula. So let's get moving. Select move. All right. There are three options for movement. Carriage, train, and boat. Carriage is moving by road, and you can only travel one space at a time. Roads are the red lines between cities. Train allows movement by railway, but requires a rail ticket. Your rail ticket will detail how far you can move and which railways you can travel. Yellow, white, or either. But allows travel to, from, and between sea regions. You can only move to a blue a sea region uh, by port. Yeah, makes sense. Since Dracula is on land, let's move by road. Select the carriage. Okay. Notice how all the possible locations you can move are highlighted. Select one of the highlighted locations and move the locations. Go here. Great, you have taken your first step in the hunt for Dracula. The hunters can only move during the day phase, unless a card effect of states otherwise. Move is the only way to find Dracula. Choose your path wisely. All hunters are human controlled in this tutorial, so let's repeat this action for all the other hunters. Dr. Seward's next. Move by carriage. Uh, let's go over here. Milan. I don't know what the number means. Same for Van Helsing. There we go. Cologne. And Mina Harker. Over by carriage. There we go. Here. Paris. Gay pity. Once all the hunters have acted, the phase changes to the dusk phase. Since Dracula is hidden and no hunters have as any event cards, the game progresses straight to the night phase. During the night phase, hunters can make another action, but however, you cannot move during the night. Since we cannot move, we should prepare for the next day phase. A rail ticket will allow us to move faster and cover more ground. So, reserve a rail ticket. Reserving a ticket draws you a new rail ticket. Normally, you would only get one ticket. However, Godling can get two. All right. But you can travel faster. Maximum tickets you can have anytime is two. Reserving more tickets than you can hold will require you to discard one before drawing a new one. When we eventually find Dracula, we will need tools to defeat him. We can prepare for this by gathering some supplies. Supplying is the only way to get new items and event cards. Large cities will get you both item and event cards. Small cities will only get you one and event card. So if I'm Dracula, I'm moving by small cities then. Because why wouldn't you go to the big cities, right, to get the maximum items? Just like with rail tickets, uh, Godalming gets to, to draw an extra item card when supplying. So Godalming's pretty nice. Hunters can only hold three items and three items while... Not three items and events while Seward can have four. Hunter draws more items or events than they can hold and must discard some card of choice. Each hunter will need their own tools. Let us supply Van Helsing. I choose supply. A stake. Alright, get stakeums. And Dracula is receiving something. 
This time you draw a Dracula event card. These are events with a red bat on the back. When drawn in the night phase, these go directly to Dracula, who can use them against the hunters. Oh. So you can have bad things happen because you're preparing. All right. But if you draw a Dracula event card during the day, it is discarded. So be careful when supplying during the night phase. Oh, okay. So supply during the day phase is better. Let's have Mina supply. Rifle. And money trail. Final phase of the round is the Dracula phase. During this phase, Dracula will make his actions, including playing events. Dracula must always move as part of the, his turn. This will add a new location to his trail and an attached encounter card. Once Dracula has completed his turn, it rolls into a new day starting at dawn phase. Like dusk, event cards may be played, and if Dracula has moved to a location with a hunter combat, will start. You complete your first round of Fury Dracula. Next tutorial. Load him in. <clears throat> now he's a bunch of cards. As Dracula moves around the board, he leaves a trail of hideouts in up to six locations. In order to find him, we must find these locations and follow his trail to Dracula. Let's make a move to find Dracula. Select move button. All right. Select carriage. Now travel here. Belgrad. Dracula has graciously chosen not to ambush you. I discovered a location on Dracula's trail. The closer the location revealed is to the first lot leftmost, the closer we are to Dracula. Okay. So we found... Okay, I see. Dracula's always on the first location and on his trail and may not move back across any location currently on his trail. So by knowing where he has been, we can work out where he is going. Let's see if we can find any more hideouts. Move him. Okay. Move sword. Okay, so Belgrade. So one, two, three. Well, I don't know how Dracula can move, but maybe he'll be going this way. He can be going that way. Let's go here. Florence. No such luck this time. That's okay. There are other ways to find Dracula. We can also use event cards and character abilities to help us find Dracula. Nina Harker's ability allows her to discover Dracula is in the same region as her. This can only be used if she's in the same location as another hunter on her turn. Move Van Helsing to the same location. Proc. Now we can trigger Mina Harker's special ability. Select this special option from the actions bar. Uh, this psychic bond. There we go. Dracula is in Austro-Hungaria. Message displayed showing the outcome of the auction. This, uh, in this, in this case, Dracula is in this region. We are closing in. Means ability can be used in day or night phase as long as there is another hunter at her location. This can be a great way to narrow down where Dracula is. It's Lord Godalming's turn again. The hideout he discovered has an attached encounter card. Encounters are traps set by Dracula to delay the hunters. Reveal the encounter card, we must perform a search. Search? Some items uh, can be used to aid in your search. They must be declared as being used before the search action takes place. Select the stake item. View this card before you search. If you reveal a vampire encounter or hoax, this card, both this card and that card. Notice how encounter cards have two effects. The effect on the top is reveal... Effect trigger when the encounter card is revealed. Okay. Aristocratic Vampire. You cannot ambush with this card. The hunter can become delayed for, to discard this card. Reveal this location card. Advance the influence track by four. Then clear this hideout and the hideouts on the fourth, fifth, and sixth space of the trail. Oh. Effect the bottom is known as the Mature Effect. This effect triggers when the encounter card drops off the trail as Dracula moves. Mature effects are always more powerful than the reveal effect. And off to raise Dracula's influence. You should try to clear the encounters with, when possible, where possible to stop Dracula. The effect on this card allows the hunter to choose to become delayed to discard the encounter. When it's delayed, their next action must be spent and to move this effect. This means a lost turn for the hunter. Press continue. Discarding a Socratic vampire. We discard stake. 
Like we played our stake. Stake immediately discards any hoax or vampire encounter. Okay, so stake undid that. Okay, so you don't have to worry. Encounter's over. Let's continue here. Let's pass with him. Pass with Van Helsing. Select pass with Mina. Why? We feel like we have Dracula Trap. That's Dracula's turn. When he finishes, we can continue to track him. It's Dagon. We continue the hunt. Move Lord Godalming to Sesgard. Where's Sesgard? Cancel a second. I can't cancel, so I guess carriage? Sarajevo, Bucharest. I can't go to where they want me to go. What? Oh, no, it's right here. <laughs> he was in the way. We discovered another trail. Oh, location track is trail. Rats is an ambush. Hunter suffers two damage. Return this card face up to its hideout unless the hunter reveals a pistol or a rifle. When Hunter discovers a new location on the trail, Dracula can choose to ambush with the attached encounter card. An ambush, the encounter card is revealed, then its effect is resolved. Some encounter cards have extra conditions that usually offer the hunter the opportunity to reveal items in order to reduce the effect of encounter. In this case, discard the rat's encounter card. Some encounter cards cannot be used as an ambush, such as aristocratic vampire seen before. Continue. Health is now at 9. Okay. As mentioned earlier, rats have an additional uh, condition to reveal an item card of a specific type to discard it. Unfortunately, we don't have it. And which is not complete, press OK. No cards are revealed. Next tutorial. I assume it's going to explain how to kill Dracula eventually. We're going to kill Dracula, right? Better get some more water in me. For this tutorial, we'll be playing as both the countries and Dracula. So this, this is so we can properly show how, you how combat works. Okay. If a hunter is in the same city as Dracula at dawn or dusk, then combat will begin. Dracula's in Rome, so let's move Mina Harker there to start combat. Rome. What are they doing in Rome of all places? Dracula revealed. Combat engaged. Mina Harker, select combat card. Okay. Now that we're in combat, we'll talk you through how combat works. In this game, you have a hand of cards that represent your options in combat. As a hunter, you always have dodge, punch, and escape cards in combat. If you have any item cards in your inventory, you'll be able to use them to combat in combat too. Let's like punch card to punch Dracula. Punch Dracula. Hawker, right, punch! And go engaged hunter suffers two damage. Then if it is not okay. Now it's Dracula's turn to select the card he will use in combat. This knight choose any hunter in this in this combat to suffer two damage. So they can do four damage if it's night, but it's dusk, so it's morning. Let's find fangs. Escape as a bat. Knight and Dracula was in combat. You may clear your current hideout and secretly choose up to two city roadway that is not a way home. I feel like Dracula would run a lot, right? Bangs, here we go. Recover two damage. If it's night and the engaged hunter is mesmerized, they are bitten or removed from this combat. Then advance the influence track by one. Otherwise, if engaged, hunter suffers two damage. Mesmerize. Cancel the engaged hunter's combat card. That hunter is mesmerized. You suffer one fewer damage from the hunter's weapon cards. Keep this card face up uh, until the end of combat. Wow. All right, so fangs. Once Hunter and Dracula have chosen the cards to use in combat, they were placed face down. Cards are then revealed and you see if chosen card cancels Dracula's combat card. Let's see these cards in action. Alright. Dracula's in max health cannot be healed further. But he bites Mina. 
And she punches him in the face. All right. If an icon on Dracula's card matches any icon on the Hunter's card, then Dracula's attack is cancelled. Oh, I see. Any cards that weren't cancelled then resolve their effects, including combat dodge. Now see how we, you can't use the punch card this round. When Hunter uses a card, it won't be available for the next round, so choose carefully. Let's select dodge. Okay. We'll look at the other one real quick. Escape. Remove from this combat. Okay. Try not to die. Dodge! Dracula always has at least five cards in his hand and draws his cards from the Dra combat cards from Dracula. Dracula can also use the plotting card to search for a specific card in the combat deck. Try it now. Try to use the plotting card. Search your combat deck for one card of your choice, then place the chosen card in your hand and shuffle the combat deck. Keep this card face up until the end of combat. You may flip this card face down to cancel the engaged hunter's punch, dodge, or escape. Plotting. Dracula plots and she does nothing. Here's the deck for to escape it and miss a card and select. Escape is missed. Alright. Now escape is missed will be available for Dracula's next round. Combat can end in a number of different ways. Either Dracula plays six combat cards, escapes, or he's influenced to 13 triggers as one condition. Hunters can also reduce Dracula to zero health in order to win the game and end combat. Combat will also end if all the hunters in combat are bitten, defeated, or escape. Speaking of escaping, let's try that now. Find and select the punch card uh, as the hunter. Punch! Dracula 6 combat card. You can use escape as missed, uh, but only if his pride ability is satisfied. You only escape Dracula if you've used more combat cards than there are despair tokens in play. Because we play two combat cards, we now can use escape as missed. Despair tokens? Combat. Use plotting to cancel hunter card. Oh, that's what plotting is. Okay. So, yes. So, Dracula is hard to beat. They have to wear him down. Okay. Makes sense. Remember, if you plan on taking down Dracula, you'll need to be prepared for combat. Continue game? Nope. So was that the last tutorial? Okay, let's play the game now. So that was 20 minutes of tutorial. Let's play the game. Uh, look at Learn to Play again really quick. There's YouTube guides. I guess we've learned enough, huh? Okay, let's go ahead and just play the game now. Let's do it. Play. Local game. Good to see this long line multiplayer. Yeah, they're all me. Yes, yeah. Three placement layers, rumor tokens. I don't know what any of that is. Power cards. We'll just play with what we got. Go. We face Dracula. All right. So, okay, so they're placed for us. I guess we could have chosen them to get the place and choose them. No one but a woman can help a man. Each new day brings new places to explore. Am I just watching AI? I just think we must be mad. Maybe here we'll bring us more luck with our sake. Oh, you can play as Dracula. You can play as them. Okay, they're using AI. Uh, maybe here we'll bring us more luck with our search. I'm trying to understand. Dracula isn't in Galia. Okay. Those one to play. This is the game clock. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, so they're playing. Am I Dracula? Oh yeah, one versus many. We're Dracula. Okay. But well, we can also play as the many? I have no idea. Alright, scouts. The game said Jack was the AI, but it looks like they're the AI. Or you can play as one side and the AI is the other side. Is my assumption here? Alright, 
Or did I just make this a full AI battle and I screwed up? Each time Dracula moves to a new location, Zag's a person counter as well. Okay. First slot is always Dracula's current position on the map. To find him, you must follow his trail. And so long as I would ask. Ah, quit! I think uh, that was all AI, so I screwed up. Let's try that again. So we can play as the one or we can play as the many. Local game. New game. So these were all AIs. I can choose to be him or I can choose to be them. That's what's going on. Oops. All right. I choose to be them. Let's go. That was my mistake. Looks like they have specific places they're placed the first round. Okay. So... Yeah, let's move. Let us move here. Bucharest. We will move to... Milan. Move to Milan. I don't know what these numbers mean. I'm gonna do what we did. Move to Brussels. This is her special ability. Yeah, okay, so the game explains things. You psychic bonds. Dracula is not in Gallia. Dracula has moved. Get a ticket. Because tickets for him? Nice. Two tickets to paradise. Is it? Get ticket. Oh, we can only have two tickets total as a team? Oh. What? Let me double check. Or did I misunderstand? Oh, try to get a ticket. Confused. No, no, one, one. Can't figure out what I said. I got mayor here and get tickets? I don't know. Everyone get tickets. Two, one. I am confused. All things are as they are. So for some reason Dracula took damage. Oh, it's because he needs to feed every night? I can only assume he needs to feed every night. Okay. So, let's supply ourselves. Garlic wreath, sweet. A pistol, sweet. And discard the Dracula card we could have gotten. Woo, that's good. Get supply. So Godalming is really strong. We got a vent and everything. Supply. Got a rifle. And Dracula vent. Woo. He's gonna no not that. Supply. Heavenly host. Hired scouts. All right. Choose two cities. Dracula must reveal those city locations. Okay. There. Okay. Is he here? Madrid and Paris are not hideouts. Okay. So it is night. So. Ah, uh, he can only have this many tickets, so he has nothing more he can do. We could pass. Pass. Yeah. Pass. Pass. Yeah, what's so special about these guys? When supply in a large city, draw two cards instead of one. Privilege. When you receive a card, gain two instead of one. Wait on it. 
When you or another hunter in your city rests, that hunter recovers two of damage. Okay. You can have up to four items. When you trade, instead of item cards, you may choose to trade event cards with a hunter in any city. Alright. You have two bite spaces. You are defeated when you would gain a third bite token. Alright. She's already got one taken. So, Ben Helsing's just weaker. Okay. As an action, if you were in the same city as another hunter, force Dracula to tell you if he is in the region. Okay. Dracula has a bunch of things. Okay, Dracula has a lot going on. Okay, so... Oh yeah, get another ticket. There we go. Dracula has not... Fed at all is my understanding? Blues and reds, I don't understand. All I know is let us move. By train! Let us go to Budapest. Supply. For now, let's just gather supplies and we'll start running around. Dogs. Oh yeah, Dragon's not getting anything because we're doing that. Let's move though. So we're in Galia. Let's go over to one of the other locations. So train. Let's go to Cologne. I'm gonna have them hang out together because we can do group uh, things. Has a special ability. At night, he'll get another ticket. Oh, you can draw a ticket that's worth two, or you can draw a ticket that's worth one, is my understanding? I'm trying to understand. That's something that wasn't explained too well. Special ability. He isn't in Germania either. All right. That's the British thing these days is disarmable. So Dracula is just getting hurt right now because he hasn't fed on anybody. Okay. I don't understand what blue means. Eh, no idea. Okay, so... Gather more supplies. Pistol? Heavenly Host? Oh, hmm, okay. You are engaged, Hunter. If you are the engaged Hunter Fangs is played, you are, you are bitten and removed from this combat, then discard this card. Otherwise, the vampire suffers or damage. Oh, it's holy water! Keep holy water. Garlic Wreath. Playing the combat after you suffer damage, not a bite from Fangs. The vampire suffers four damage. Cancel and discard this card which causes results against the other one. Alright, we'll discard a pistol. Yep. Yeah, he's good on items now, so he can just go he can hang out and look around now. Hired scouts. Okay, so we're hiring scouts now. We know he's not in these two areas, so let's search here. Liverpool and Realm. Okay, Realm. And Liverpool. Nope, neither are hideouts, darn. Scouts are nice, but not working out. Well, I have two items right now, so I can get two more, so let's go get two more. Supply. More Duggies. Renewed Vigor. Okay, we need more items. So supply. Crucifix. Sweet, that sounds useful. And chartered carriage. 
She needs supplies. Rifle, nice. And speedy telegraph. Though so he's got three items, so he can just hang it. He can run around now. Pass. He's got nothing to gain. This dude's very full. He's good. Pass. What's this? Guarded carriage. What's it do? What's it do? What's it do? No, okay, there. Before you move by railway, spend one of your tickets to move the city up to four. Okay, that's all. Yeah, big movement. I think he's good, pass. And then she will... Take the risk, let's go. Do it. Oh no, that's psychic bond, wrong one. I'm gonna get supply. Oops. Dracula's doing something. Master skill. I need vigor. Play it, Don. During this day of this hunter phase, each hunter may perform one additional action. They cannot perform the same twice. Or I can. Okay. I need vigor. Play it, Don. I need vigor is now in play. Play at dawn. During both day and night phases, the hunters can perform actions in any order. Ignore the activation order. I'm confused by what's happening. What happened? <laughs> Cards that are in play. Okay. You can do additional actions. So I'm guessing they can supply and move. So move. And then they can also supply. So let's do supply. Fast horses. Heavenly host. Or uh, what's fast horses? Heavenly Host and I guess Fast Horse. Do it. There we go. Discarding these cards. Didn't gain anything I want to change out. Behind the Veil. Reveal Dracula's event cards and his hand of encounter cards. Choose one of those encounter cards to discard. Got Zgani Mob. Aristocratic. Unnatural Fog. New vampire, got new bodyguards. Okay. Three on influence. Mister Crowley vampire seems really bad. That seems really bad. We just get to see everything they have? Okay. Okay. Alright, that's a lot of bad things I don't want to deal with. Alright, choose the card to discard. Aristocratic Vampire. Okay. So he can move. Go here. In Genoa. And supply. Holy bullets! Oh snap! Jack doesn't get that. What if we travel by train? Okay, guard that. This allows them to go pretty far. Okay, that's cool. I want to go over here, though. Let's go to the English Channel. Go to Paris. Amin is here, so he can supply as well. Supply. Garlic. Sister Agatha. 
Oh, there's an ally. Search a location, choose one city. Dracula must reveal the city's location card. Ally. After Dracula resolves, escape is Search. Oh, there's an ally. Are you over here, Dracula? Are you in Athens? Oh, uh, all right. Hey, one of her cards is revealed, so he knows she's got Heavenly Host. So I need her to move. Oh, I, where I think Dracula is? That's interesting. Move. Go to Brussels. Can I just road there? I could road there. Fly. Jacobs. Lucy's revenge. Interesting. Now it's night. We need vigor has been removed from play. Okay. Pass. Don't know if I'm playing smart, but that's what I'm doing. Pass. At night they wait. I'm doing it. Night they wait. Might be the wrong thing to do, but it's what I'm doing. Yes. Long use credit and over centuries. Oh. These and shadows here. As long as yeah, after he gets a whole six, what happens? I don't know. Let's just move. By train. Here. To Venice. Oh, we found the start of a tra trail. Hideout has been discovered. Okay. Close to the uh, trail goes right to Dracula. And that's encounter. Hideouts contain counter cards. Or reveal the encounter card. Use the search action. Okay. So that means if this is the last place and he didn't we didn't see him here, he's gotta be going this way, I figure. Move to Florence. See if we're right. Oh. Move like carries the Brussels. Have her use her... No, no, no. She's going to supply first. Special ability at night. Dogs! Okay. Ah, he's got both this car. Okay. Uh, lose dogs. Lose dogs. I think steak's very important. Consecrated ground. Reserve ticket. I don't understand what the hell I'm doing. He's good. Pass. Use your ability again. Where the hell is Dracula? Did we miss his trail? Oh, it's no longer on the trail now. But he hasn't gained any influence yet either. So this was the start. So we were there. Maybe Zagreb? Where's Zagreb? Can't get the Zagreb, so we'll go here. Munich. Munich wasn't on the trail. Hmm.
Go here. Go to Milan. We're not finding him, which is troubling me, which means he's got to be in the southeast. I gotta start moving. Go to Paris. Also go to Paris. Together they'll go down there. That's what I'm gonna do. Nothing to do. This is an interesting board game. I have no idea what I'm doing yet. Another ticket. Give me these one tickets. I don't know how that works. Now we've really lost this trail. It's a new week. As each week passes, the level of despair will increase. When despair level reaches three, Dracula gains three influence each time he adds a city to his trail. What? What? So if we take too long, he gets really strong. So we have to hurt and find his ass. Okay. So let's go over here. Zagreb. We need to, I think he's in the southeast. I gotta head there. And Vinci's in the southeast, so we gotta go back to Florence and then we'll head down there. They're gonna go down here. Rain! Go down here. Come on. Auto camera, you're not helping me out right now. Yeah, I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna have her do the same thing. Get down here. Back to auto. All we can do is pass. I'll get a train ticket. Real quick, zoom out. Where does that go? I assume he's in the east, but I don't I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. I guess we'll see what happens. Okay. So, train ticket. Do it again. Nangalia still. Alright. Alright, he healed up something. I don't know what the hell these cards are. My Dracula's doing something. Sarajevo. Alright. Carriage to Rome. Boat. Okay, anyone in this area. Okay. So you go to see... Oh, it takes two turns. Okay. That was confusing. So go to the sea. You can go to anywhere in this area. Alright. House. Hmm. Very confusing. But alright. All I can do is pass.
Go to Valona. A big problem is I don't understand. Can Dracula only go like one square at a time as well, or can he go crazy? Naples. Nepal? Oh. Over here. Yeah, we gotta start spreading out. Go over here. He would be anywhere. We're on his trail for like a moment. I wonder if I'm too passive. Always possible. Prayer from the hideout has matured and its effect will now be resolved. Encounter cards mature when the hideout at the end of the trail is pushed off Dracula's moves. Any encounter cards will increase Dracula's influence when maturing, so the hunter should aim to keep the trail clear. Oh, Jesus, so... The Varna was revealed as their last place. Where the hell is Varna? So we went from, like, what was it? Venice to... Or Venice wherever to Varna? Where's Varna at? Munich, Vienna, Prague... Where the hell is Varna? Castle Dracula, Varna. Oh god, he this is Castle Dracula. So he's over here now. Crap, I lost his trail. He was this way. Now I gotta go up north again. Shoot. Gotta hurry my ass. Carriage back up. Sarajevo. Gotta cut him off over in Budapest or somewhere. I was on to him, then I lost track. Oops. My boat! Go back over here now. She's gonna be the long game now. She's far away. Pass. Pass. Oh man, okay. <clears throat> Pass. Alright, it's obvious. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. So, ah, uh, crap. This is a Castle Dracula card. That, this just tells you he's there. Oh, Blue Man, he was in the water. So he was in the blues, and then he went over to the reds. Okay, maybe? My only assumption? Okay, we'll stop there. It's almost an hour. Damn, I'm bad at this. Alright. I gotta play this some more, and then I'll decide if I think this is, like, definitely something to recommend. It's an interesting idea, but I don't know how good it translates as a digital. But we'll do more in the future. So that right there is the game. I have fun with it if I'm watching. That's what's up as it. Having fun. Thanks for coming by, and see you next time.